you know a replication is very intricate process and there are many chances of a mistake sometimes uh, 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 some wrong nucleotides are incorporated in the uh, uh, new strand so uh, but the replication uh, machinery achieves a remarkably high degree of accuracy using a proofreading mechanism it has its own proofreading mechanism which removes wrongly incorporated nucleotides however this proofreading is not foolproof some mis incorporated nucleotides escape detection and become a mismatch between the newly synthesized strand and the template strand so uh, there uh, may occur some mismatches if the mis incorporated nucleotide is not subsequently detected and replaced the sequence change will become permanent in the genome which is called mutation during uh, a second round of uh, replication so in the first round uh, a mis incorporation has taken place a uh, base has been incorpor incorporated wrongly but in the second uh, round of replication the mis incorporated nucleotide will direct the incorporation of its own complementary nucleotide into the newly synthesized strand at this point the mismatch will no longer exist instead it will have resulted in a permanent change a mutation in the dna sequence so in this way uh, 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 in the first round of replication uh, a nucleotide is uh, may be mismatched but in the second round that mismatch results into a permanent change in the sequence so which is called a mutation so here i can uh, try to explain you a little more about this uh, change about this misincorporation uh, so uh, this is a double stranded dna it has uh, some sequence for example a t g c c t uh, on the other uh, strand it will have a g g c a and t so uh, during uh, replication the strands are uh, open and new strands are synthesized so for example uh, we say uh, here is t and then c c g t a here in the new strand uh, in front of t will come a but uh, maybe in front of c uh, g should come but due to incorporation here uh, it may uh, come t so uh, after replication two new molecules will be formed and uh, these two molecule will have the sequence as a t g c c t this is parental strand and in this strand there is misincorporation and uh, in front of t is a and in front of c here becomes t incorporated which is actually mis incorporation the rest is the correct so g c a and t so in the next replication this strand uh, is same a t g c c t and the other has a mis incorporated nucleotide which is a t g c t a so uh, when uh, the second round will take place this strand in the second round 
the complementary strand of this strand will be T A G C A T. So in this strand here becomes the permanent change. So this is the mutation. So up till here, up till here, it was misincorporation, but in the second round it has become a mutation. So in this way, these misincorporations lead to mutations.